Campers can look for some improvements coming to nearby campgrounds and riverbanks in the Kern River Valley thanks to some grant money supporting community conservation efforts. Eyewitness News reporter Emma Goss explains how that money will be used. Emma? Dave hey, Rochelle, the grant money is going toward campsite improvements, education programs, and reintroducing a native fish that's been missing from the Kern River for at least a decade. 2018 has been a record-breaking year for Kern River Conservancy with the amount of volunteers we've had and the participation from the community. The nonprofit that cleans campgrounds and raises funds for preservation and education hasn't seen a year this good in a long time. We've grown from five years ago where it was like 10 people to now, you know, we're bringing about 100 to 130 people. And this week they were awarded $32,000, 17,000 coming from the Kern Community Foundation and the rest from volunteer in-kind donations. $20,000 also came to the recently remodeled Friends of the Kern Hatchery, now able to move forward with their plan to reintroduce the Kern River rainbow trout into the river. This extra money goes for en enhancing everything that has to do with, with raising those fish, from gathering the eggs to spawning them in our hatchery and raising them to the point where they can finally be planted out in the river. It's been almost a decade since the hatchery last saw any Kern rainbow trout, but by next August, they'll be back. Very exciting, yeah. <laughs> the Kern River Conservancy will use its funding to educate the public about the trout and how to protect it. There isn't much of an education platform out there for native trouts on the Kern River. So we're hoping to jumpstart this program and hopefully it catches on with other agencies and or organizations. A Kern rainbow comeback at the tail end of a bright year for the river. Keeps Kernville kind of on the front page. We're proud of this river and to have a, a fish uh, dedicated just to the Kern River is, is pretty important. And the National Forest Service was also awarded $150,000 that will go toward building new restrooms at campsites in the Kern River Valley. Reporting in studio, Emma Goss, Eyewitness News.